Is this the best Marvel Legends vision? Today we'll be having a look at Marvel Legends The Void Build-A-Figure Wave Marvel's Vision. The amazing android Vision commands unearthly powers and abilities to fight for humanity as a member of the Avengers. So we have gotten plenty of Visions over the past few years. Unfortunately, this is my only one because I didn't start getting these until after all those Visions came out. But without at least so, I would say this one is the best one. It is on the new Vulcan body, which is majority of what figures are being put on now. And I have no complaints because it's way better than, from what I've seen, it's way better than the Bucky Cat body. The old one. But no. This has to be the best Marvel Legends vision ever made. Now, on I know some people have had issues with the paint. I mean, there is a little bit right there. A little scuffing or just, it's not uneven. Now this part right here, you can see where there was, there was like, well, it's not it's like a little joiner or something was, but obviously you can't move it. And this is where that was painted. I mean, and then the same down here, you can see this, this isn't perfect. You can see like a little paint right there. We'll see if it'll show up on the camera. You see the little greens that's just kind of leaking through. Now, would have been better if they had completed new molds and just made this kind of like a separate piece and not painted it probably, but it's fine either way. Now, the head sculpt is probably perfect. The little gem right there is perfectly fine. This is painted on there. That's fine with me. The cape obviously just plugs into the back. Nothing too special. There we go. But accessory wise, it just comes with a set of two open hands, kind of like just reaching hands, reaching for, I don't know what it's reaching for. Maybe, maybe Ultron's throat. I don't know. And then two fists. Obviously these are the bigger set of hands. But yeah. And like I said, it is the Vulcan body mode. Same as the Black Panther that came in this wave. Same body mold, Vulcan body. Actually, I'm forgetting an accessory because this does come with a build a figure piece. Comes with the head of the void. A creepy little crab looking monster. But yeah, it's got nice little paint. I like mine, came up pretty good. Has a little tendrils coming out of its head, looking kind of like a crab, lobster, sea creature, and there it goes. Alright, it's back. Yep, there's that. I set that off to the side. And we can move. Here's a nice little comparison. Obviously, they're like the same height. Same body mold. No big deal there. Now, at first I did have issues with him standing, but then I actually got him to stand. It took a little minute, but trying to get him in a pose was not the best thing in the world. But, yeah. Now, one thing I do wish that Marvel Legends would include, more often than not, is a flight stand for the figures that can fly. Instead of me going out have to get one. Fortunately, I don't have one, so Vision's just going to stand on the display shelf just regularly like this. Nothing special. He's just going to stand there like that. Oh, and there he goes. <clears throat> now, I don't even have a Scarlet Witch to pair with him, but that's next on my list. But he looks fine. Perfectly. I'm barely happy with this figure. I was very excited to get this, considering this is probably the best looking vision I've ever seen on action figure form. I know people will talk about the... Was it Mayfix the release one? I don't remember, but I click mainly Marvel Legends. And... This is probably the best one that I've seen. The cape's fine. It's just the, kind of like a little hard plastic. Ooh, there's a little black spot on mine. Oh, I don't really like that. That's not a big deal, though. 
just normal cape just plugs right into the back if you wanted to you could take it off but i'm not going to but no <clears throat> it is a it is a very nice figure it is i have no problems with this figure really just minor little paint details like i like this probably would have been better sculpted than having this little like if i can pick up on the camera like a little indentation or whatever you see the green is kind of looking through right there um the head is perfectly fine i love the head sculpt the vol on this on the Vulcan body this is like wonderful well yes i know technically the trunks are technically supposed to look a little different they just made it like this so that way it doesn't look weird um yeah there's just color on the back not much detail which seems to happen a lot um but yeah it's i'm this is probably this it's probably my most wanting figure next to power princess still don't have that i will be getting that one soon um the other ones are you just kind of get them for the void builder figure wave Um, so articulation wise, same same regular Vulcan body, double jointed elbows. Head can go this way kind of, but the kind of cloak or the collar piece for the cape kind of gets in the way. Head can look up and down that much, down that much, ab crunch that that much forward. Can't really do much back unless you unplug the cape, and it kind of gets it going there. Shoulders can move that far back because the cape hinders and. That far back that way um wrist can go swivel up and down so side to side now my waist are the waist on mine's a little loose but there's nothing too nitpicky but waist swivel thigh swivel calf swivel double jointed pinless knees if i can get the other joints a little stiff i don't want to uh, there we go. Double joint and pinless knees. <clears throat> Cast swivel. Feet can go up and down. But they can't side to side. I was about to say, I thought they'd go side to side. It's a little stiff. Yeah. Uh, normal base articulation for the Vulcan body. I know people are very excited to get their hands on this one. I pre ordered most of the ones in this wave. <clears throat> so, yeah. But, there. So that was Marvel's Vision from the Void Builder figure wave. Uh, this was probably my favorite figure to get from this wave. I was really excited for it. Well, yes, there's a lack of accessories we're noticing with some of these figures. And I, you know, I wish there was more accessories, but there's only... I guess they didn't want to put any effect pieces or anything with these, but just two sets of hands, but... I hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more reviews and toy hunts. And if there's anything that you'd like me to review on this channel, please comment down below. And I wish everyone have a great day. Thank you.